More than 200 roles over the course of a six-decade career. The legacy of Michael Lonsdale, who died on Monday in Paris, the city where the British-French actor was born in 1931. Respected as much for his big screen appearances as he was for his contribution to art house cinema and theatre, Lonsdale was known for his silky but imposing voice and distinctive goatee beard. Raised in London and Casablanca during the Second World War, he returned to Paris in 1947 where he began studying dramatic arts. He launched his career as a theatre actor in 1955 and made his film debut a year later. His big break came in 1968 when he appeared in two films by legendary French filmmaker François Truffaut. His career then veered between the mainstream and the experimental, appearing in films by art house directors such as Louis Bonuel and Alain René, as well as in blockbusters like Day of the Jackal. For millions of people though, he will always be remembered as the sadistic industrialist Hugo Drax in the 1979 Bond film Moonraker. A career highlight came in 2010 when he played a Trappist monk in Of Gods and Men, for which he won his first and only César Award for Best Supporting Actor, amongst other accolades. It's so surprising that I've won four awards. It's a lot to get all that in one go. Lonsdale never married and had no children. He was a man of faith, something which he explored through several of his film roles. In a 2016 interview, he said that he had no anxiety about dying, explaining, I give myself a reason, it's life.